Okay, so as you saw in the last video, when I tried running the hair physics on the character uh, with the animation going and then moving uh, my perspective, essentially um, my graphic card GPU crashed. Um, not my whole computer, just the GPU. And I had to restart my computer every time that happens um, to get the GPU working again. Um, so essentially, um, I'm using Unreal Engine 7, uh, not 7, Unreal Engine 4.25 Preview 7. Um, the problem with Preview 7 is the hair dynamics are very finicky and unstable. Preview 5 was extremely stable, but I accidentally upgraded to 6, Preview 6, and Preview 6, the dynamics actually were totally ruined. So um, Unreal Engine, since Preview 5, has actually been messing up the um, hair physics a bit, from as far as I can tell. Um, hopefully it'll get everything that was in Preview 5 working again, as well as uh, it originally was. Um, okay, so to get, I'm just going to show you a couple quick things. Uh, before then, I'm going to mention, um, uh, I'm hoping by this Friday to have the church scene of the script um, mostly done you know, done, 90% done, as in cosmetic finishes still after that. That way, maybe on Friday or something, I might be able to Skype with you and uh, review things. Um, make sure, yeah, review things a bit. Anyway, um, so basically, to make this character like this, and Marvelous Designer, I had to make his outfit and get stitched together. Um, it's a bit of a learning curve to get it quite right. Um, and then I had it simulated, which um, Marvelous Designer has its own way of creating, uh, putting textures on. I haven't figured out how to get it out of Marvelous Designer into Unreal Engine or Blender um, fully correctly yet. Um, it's something I'll have to learn uh, later, but it's that for me to do it now would be nitpicky. I actually need to hurry up and get the animations and the sets uh, designed and made and everything talking. I can always add the you know texture color uh, later. It's not that big of an issue. Um, so you notice that his arms were missing in the simulation. Uh, the reason for that is originally this guy's arms and hands were. Um, rubbing up against the shirt, which we're just dragging it up and getting all knotted up. Um, and it is rubbing up, which is causing the shirt to ride up over these frames, um, instead of staying down like it's supposed to, or mostly down. Anyway, um, so essentially in Blender, I had to make a copy of my character. Um, yeah, copy of my character. And in the copy version, I had to delete the arms, essentially. I had to go into edit mode and delete the vertexes for the arms. As you saw there. And um, by deleting the vertex for the arms, um, I was able to get it you know, correct enough. Um, so basically the workflow is, okay, so basically the workflow is, um, the animation has to be figured out in, uh, Blender. Then I export to Marvel's Designer, do the simulation for the animation, and then, uh, bring all that back into Blender, um, so I'm exporting the character as a limbic to Marvelous Designer and exporting the clothes out of Marvelous Designer as a limbic, but it's, um, I think it's called a Gawe. 
I'm exporting it out. Uh, this one. And um, I have a video that goes over that more in detail. And then I'm exporting the clothing as Limbic with uh, and opening up as media something cache um, in Unreal Engine. And then the character I'm exporting as an FBX. Um, and the hair I'm exporting as Limbic as well. Um, with uh, some special add ons added on, a uh, groom add on in uh, Unreal Engine. Um, so you can see here, I've actually figured out how to give him better eyebrows, but I'm still working on how to get it into um, Unreal Engine properly. I'm not going to do that right now. Probably after like my script's mostly done, if I have any extra time, I'll go back and figure out how to get these in properly. I have a few ideas, but they'll take some hours of testing. And, you know, the semester is not that much longer before the ending, so I gotta uh, do things uh, strategically uh, towards how I use my time at this point. Um, so, yeah. Also, I'm going to do one more semester, one credit class to make sure that the paper is done in time. Um, I'll send you the paperwork uh, for signing up for that. Um, yeah, I'll send you that probably tomorrow or, well, today. Today is tomorrow. It's middle of the night, sort of. Anyway. Um, yeah, I have some tutorials that go deeper into much of this, not everything. Anyway, so that's it for this week. Um, I'll contact you with um, uh, what day we should Skype to go over what I've done and where I, I need to head it, you know, head everything over to. Anyway, that's it.